hoping for an absolute battering. 5 nil. Make it 10. Who's going the opener tonight? In Kunku. Hopefully. So far this season, we've played tissue paper and wheelbarrow. Woo! Uh, Cole Palmer will score two goals. Cole Palmer won't be scoring any goals because he's not playing. I can tell you that for free. Check. Why is Daisy looking like a pundit? That's that's the plan. Is, it, is this good? Is this a good setup? This is kind of the setup that I think I need upstairs. Maybe just like a smaller table. And I need a I need a paper flip scorecard thing. Sanchez scores the first. Sanchez isn't even on. We've got uh, Gorgon, Gorgonson, Georgian, Jorgensen. I don't know how to pronounce his name properly. I have watched the video so many, so many, so many times. You know the one where it's like, Nicolas Jackson. <laughs> that one, where they're all pronouncing their names, but I still forget. <laughs> He's our B team keeper. He played for us in um, Conference League. Madrid playing, interesting. I know, this is what I said. I feel like it's a bit of a bit of a random one, but I think he's probably given him a chance because I don't know, at the end of the day, right? This game, whatever team we put out, we should still be winning. They're League Two, come on. Chelsea, Chelsea, Chelsea. <laughs> Cole Palmer's not on the bench because we're playing Barrow. Why does he, he doesn't need to be on the bench. He shouldn't need to be on the bench. We've got so many players, we should not be relying on Cole Palmer in, in games against League Two sides. It makes no sense why he would even be on the bench. I feel like I'm really far away. Should I zoom in a bit? Ooh, look how close I am now. Is this better? Give this cancel daily, but I don't even know where Barrow is. Stockholm. <gasps> Let's go! One nil! I told you! Five nil incoming! In wait, was it in Kunku's? I should have put money. Bookies, pay me right now. Oh. Come on. Five nil incoming. Come on. Oh, go on. Ooh, could have been two. Could have been two. Nearly was two. Love the hoodie. Thank you. I keep getting loads of comments on it. On like, I don't know if you guys have seen on my Instagram. You know the one with all the Chelsea tops and it's like the trend. And so many people have commented, "Oh, where's the hoodie from?" But they don't. It's it's been discontinued, or I can't find it anywhere. It was from JD like years ago, like three years ago now, four years ago. Um, it is really nice. It's really comfy as well, but. I don't think they do it anymore. There's similar versions about though. Oh, bro. Mudrick, that can't be the only thing you contribute today, please. I actually want to see you playing football, not throwing yourself on the floor, thanks. Ooh! Ooh! Let's go! Let's go! Two for two, let's go. Where's this balloon at? Come on. Oh, wrong one. Barrow get battered everywhere they go. Everywhere they go. Oh, this is the Chelsea we know and love. Come on. Who scored the goals? And Kunku, both of them. Two for two. Should be an easy, it should, yeah. But last season we made the e what should be an easy win look hard. So that's what I mean. Like it's, it's nice to see us convincingly 17 minutes in, winning against a team we should be winning against. 6-0 incoming. I said 5-0. That was my prediction. I can't believe there's more points on Barrow winning this game than Chelsea. You guys are wild. Whoever wasted their channel points, I feel sorry for you. Oh, let's go! Let's go! 3-0. Feel bad for Misha. Coach gave up on him already. I don't feel bad for him. If he doesn't perform, I'm glad that he's like, he said, if you don't perform, you're not on the team. It's as simple as that. That's how it should be. I actually really like our manager. I think um, people are saying, oh, he's too harsh. He shouldn't, shouldn't be slating um, players in the press, which I, I get, right? However, I don't think it's slating. I think he's just being honest. 
When you spend 100 mil on a player, you expect them to perform. If they don't perform, they don't play. Simple as that. What about the potential? Yeah, potential doesn't mean shit if you're not actually performing. And this is what I was saying when we signed these players for 100 mil. It's like, they're not investments. Because just because you see potential in someone doesn't mean that it's actually gonna pay off. It's what, like, if you wanna make an investment, look at someone like Cole Palmer. We play, pay a reasonable amount for him. He doubled his, doubled his um, worth in like less than a year. And he's been outstanding because he was performing where he was. He just wasn't getting play time. So you go for someone like that rather than someone where you're like, oh, they could be good. Are they good now? No. Oh, let's throw a hundred mil at them. Why? Doesn't make sense. Like there's literally no logic behind it. Pessimistic? Me, maybe a little bit. I mean, to be fair, can you blame me after the last few seasons? And after the, some of the signings we've made that have just completely flopped? Start of the season, I genuinely thought we were going to struggle again. It's actually nice to have faith in my club again. Chelsea, Chelsea, Chelsea. Three nil at half time. Lovely stuff. Go on. Shoot. Hey, let's go. Balls, very, very false. Very, very false. Very, very false. <laughs> Five for Barrow, they've got to get one first. Arsenal versus PSG, oh, can't wait to not watch it. I don't like this new format of the Champions League, by the way. I've decided, I've come to the conclusion. I don't like it. I, it just, it doesn't make much sense to me. Like, also, you don't know where you're gonna come out in the league, if that makes sense. Like, at least when you're in the groups, you can kind of figure out how many games you need to win, where you're sort of sat. You know, at the minute, it's just, it's going to be a massive free fall until the last day. You're just not going to know. I mean, I know you've got to play your best game, but like, there's no opportunity to like rest players if you, because you don't know where you're going to finish. You know what I mean? But I just, Arsenal. I The only reason I watch Arsenal is to hate watch. So, the atmosphere at the bridge is lovely. It's like my favourite thing. As soon as they start playing, you goosebumps every time. It's great. Oh yes. Bam bam bam. <laughs> Steel cat. <laughs> Surely we can get one more. Bro, if I if I get these predictions completely right, I'm gonna be so happy. I might have to start doing my TikTok predictions again. Oh my god, come on. <gasps> Tonight on Daisy Fabian News, Chelsea winning 5 0 against Barrow, League Two side Barrow. Jao Felix is off. Nkunku off to Carney Chukwemenko on. And Mark Gray. I definitely have not pronounced his name right. It's like. I don't, yeah, I feel like I say it so wrong. Mark Gay. You, you. And now for the weather. Back to you in the studio. <laughs> we want six. Go on. Woo! Good save, to be fair. Barrow get battered everywhere they go. Everywhere they go. Hey, five nil. What did I say? Chat. I called it. I actually called it. In Cuckoo, first goal. 5 0, Chelsea. I'm too good at this game. I'm too good at the game. Chelsea are too good at the game. I know it's only League Two Barrow, but we take it through to the next round. Let's go. Love to see it. We've won the Carabao Cup! Campione!